training video inside the Credit Repair Dispute software. In this training video, I'm going to show you how to use and navigate into the response screen and results screen. To access both of the screens, just hover your mouse onto the user's icon. Then choose which user you're going to be working on, either user 1, user 2, or user 3. Then click onto their profile. It would take you to the dispute manager screen. You'll see the credit score, add item section, overview, credit bureaus, creditor, and collector's screens, which is totally discussed in a different training video that you can find under training video section. Now, to access the response screen, just click on the respond tab. In this screen, this is where you can create your response letter. When you receive any updates back from the creditor, credit bureaus, or the collector. To create a response letter, just choose the creditor. Create a custom reason. Then check the date added. Choose a response letter. Inside our letter vault, you'll be able to choose response letters specifically for responding to credit bureaus, collection agencies, or creditors. So let's say we received an update from the credit bureaus. Then we want to, we want to choose we need more information letter. Once you've chosen your letter, just add your dispute. You can still delete this item if ever that you want to change the response letter or the reason. Just click on the delete icon. But once you're done, you can always hit on next and click on the preview icon as it already routed you to the print options. In this section, you can still do your final modifications into the letter. If you want to edit a couple information, you can always print it directly once you're done or save it into your hard drive. Now that completes our discussion in terms of how to access the response screen. Now let's go into the results section, which is just beside print options. Just click on the results tab. This area, this is where you should input all accounts that were deleted if you receive an update on your credit report and saw some deletions, make sure to input your deletion information right in this section. To do so, choose the account or the creditor, choose the account type, choose whether it was deleted under Experian, Equifax, or TransUnion, or if it was deleted to all. So let's say it was only deleted under Equifax. Then just click on add. You can always edit to choose if it was also deleted under Experian and TransUnion and then just hit on update or delete if ever that you want to change that information. So that completes our training tutorial for the results screen and the response screen.